So um, they're getting suited up. We're going to have the mock demonstration of a 35-foot uh, cabin cruiser. They're going to light on fire. They're going to go through the, uh, the firefighting operations. And then, like I said, one of the boats is actually specifically dedicated as a safety boat that in case something happens to the firefighting crews, they can actually go in and rescue them. Thursday's demonstration was a chance for firefighters and lifeguards to train in real-world conditions just in time for the summer boating season. Four fires were set to allow every crew time to battle blazes, which can reach temperatures of 1,100 degrees, and lifeguard crews time to rescue a volunteer victim. While attacking the fire on board the boat, firefighters hit the flames with short bursts of water to ensure the inside of the burning cabin didn't turn into a pressure cooker. What we did today was we provided some real life training scenarios for our non-career lifeguard pool that work in the summer months. Um, we augment with like kind of like force multiplication with non-career guys on our boats. Um, and basically what we did was we provided some real life training for them so that in the event they have to fight fire uh, in the summer months when they're on the boat that they've got some base of knowledge from which to go from. A lot of these guys are students and teachers and they work in other areas so we wanted to provide them with some level of training that they would be safe in the summertime. But make sure that you have your safety equipment in place like your fire extinguisher, your life jackets, one per person, throwable cushions, communication devices like handheld radio or VHF radio, and that you review the ABCs of boating which is provided by the California Department of Boating and Waterways. Uh, gives you a real good uh, frame of reference from which to kind of springboard your summer fun.